Severino out of the game got just one out Chad Green who has been a star in the middle relief for the Yankees is on two down got it. Of Molitors strike three called with such an early exit from Severino strikes out another one Bauer fights one off into center field. Hicks is there. Inning over. Five in a row set down by Green. That happened in the middle of August. Pops one into shallow center field. And Hicks coming in. David Robertson, the third pitcher of the night already for the Yankees. Ground ball hit to short. To second one, on to first, not in time. Buxton runs too well, and a run will score to tie the game. Got it. Oh, good job by Robertson. Robbie Grossman leading off the fourth, sends it to left center. Hicks there, one down. Absolutely sensational since he was acquired back from the White Sox. Here's a ground ball to short. To second one, on to first. In time. Good stretch over there by Bird. It was a real thing, and him coming in, it was clear from the get-go. He was a little overwhelmed. It's a young impact. Players on both sides of the ball now for the Twins really manifest itself here in the second half. It has been from the get-go. Kepler a swing and a high pop-up back at third foul territory. Frazier inning over. Not going. And a swing and a miss on a ball in the dirt. That's all for Castro, who strikes out for the third time tonight. 45th pitch. Swing and a miss. Five strikeouts now for Robertson. And another dominant reliever for the Yankees. 96 strikeouts in just 62 and two thirds innings. Be a little erratic with his command at times, as much as the walk totals are low. Now, Bauer sends a fly ball deep to left field, but it is caught on the track by Gardner. Will TV hustle? 3 2 again. In the air down the left field line, Gardner's got room. Kansas and Chapman. Adam Warren is on the roster. And a couple of starters, Sonny Gray and CC Sabathia. Busy night out of left for Gardner. The 0 2. And a ground ball. And a very good inning for Canley. Seventh inning stretch in the Bronx. The Yankees still lead 7 to 4. Made a grip change that allowed him to locate his fastball better. Max Kepler leads off the inning for the Twins. And quickly one down. Hey man, what an impact they've had on this game tonight. Canley over to cover, takes the feed from Bird, but he dropped the ball. And but he's out. Granite is out. Did he turn in and they tag him? Did he? Either he missed the base completely or he made some sort of a movement towards second because you could see first base umpire Mike Winters who's the crew chief watching intently until the ball was picked up and the tag was applied. Well you could see he missed the base. He, he stepped right over the base and he knew it too. Yeah probably trying to avoid what he thought was maybe a collision and he just whiffs the base. Wow. Great job by Castro of being aware of it and quickly picking up the ball and slapping a quick tag on him as you saw Granite trying to hustle his way back to first base after he knew he missed it. Watch watch Castro here pick it up quick and slap a quick tag on him. Got it. What an outing by Canley on the heels of what Green and Robertson did. This is a role this Chapman. Well, he finished this season on such a high note, throwing the ball as well as he has at any time of the year. One down. Three, two. Two down. Not thinking too far ahead at all. And they're on their way. 
The Yankees win the wild card game. They beat the Twins 8 to 4. So much of what the Yankees have been all season long. It's been bullpen, and they showed it more tonight, being able to come in in the first inning, eight and a third innings, one run, and 13 strikeouts.